So you're at a show and you're listening to one of your favorite bands and you really want to clap because you like them so much, but then your hands get really tired and they start hurting and you're like, I don't want to clap anymore, but I still really like these people. I love it! How do I get inside Simone on the outside? Do you know what you do? You build your own applause machine. At least that was what I did. This is probably one of the most well-polished projects I've ever built. I even like etched its name into here in the front in silver. How pretty is that? Very pretty. Good job, Simone. Thanks, Simone. The trickiest part about building this was probably just figuring out this entire clapping mechanism. These are actually a pair of tongs from my kitchen. And I have this motor with an oval motor head thing. Motor mount? What is, yeah, it ha you can see it. And I put this metal spring between the, the grippers. So basically the motor just forces the hands open and then they just like, these are just some hollow plastic hands that I got. They actually look really creepy. They're like an old person's hands. I normally prefer young people hands. Uh, Bleh. ooh. So basically how this is set up is I have an Arduino Uno inside of here and it's connected to a MOSFET. So we can control the speed of this motor and I have this slider. So the speed can go from snarky slow clap to breakneck speed. Let's give it a go. So here we have snarky slow clap. So as you can tell, it has some work to do on the audio quality. I don't know what it sounds like. It sounds like something that shouldn't sound like that. If you have an eye for detail, you can see that it's actually two right hands that are clapping. Because there were no left hands left. But I really hope you like this project anyway. If you did, I suggest you press the like button because... That's real appreciation. Oh, you know what will give you even bigger applause? If you subscribe, here's to everybody who subscribed. Good job, you're doing great. I don't even know if I'm laughing or crying, it's so great. How do I get inside Simone on the outside? Do I turn myself inside out? That's really creepy to think about.